Um, graphite is a very good electrical conductor because it is multiple, it is um, basically three carbons bonded to, to uh, another one and um, it has one electron um, around it. So it has a delocalized electron and therefore it can conduct electricity. Um, another thing about graphite is it's very, um, it's very, uh, okay, starting graphite again. Graphite is a very good electrical conductor. Um, this is because it has three carbons uh, bonded to another one, and that leaves it with one delocalized electron. Um, this delocalized electron allows graphite to conduct electricity. Graphite's also made of multiple different layers, as you can see here. And these layers are connected by intermolecular forces, which allow these layers to slide over each other, which is why it's a very good use in pencils, because when we write, layers of graphite slide onto our paper. It's also used in electrolysis. The next one we have is graphene. Graphene and graphite are very similar. Graphene is basically a singular layer of graphite. Um, it is nearly transparent because it's not multiple layers and therefore it's used in touchscreens. Silicon dioxide. So silicon dioxide has four oxygens around one silicon atom, as you can see here. It has a very rigid structure due to the covalent bonding between between the silicon and the oxygens, and that causes it, causes it to have a very high melting point. Um, it has a hybridization of sp3 because it has four domains. Lastly, we have um, diamond. Diamond has a tetrahedral structure, as you can see here, um, and this allows it to have a hybridization of sp3 again it has four domains um diamond is known to be the hardest substance out of the four um allotropes that we've looked at five allotropes that we've looked at um and it also has a crystal lattice from the way the tetrahedral structures lay above each other like this um, because diamond does not have any delocalized or free leaving electrons, it does not conduct electricity at all, and therefore it's very good use in jewelry. And since it can be shaped really well, um, it's also used as tools because it's hard and it can be um, used for cutting. Thank you for watching.